We have made it to CES. We are at the Sony booth right now. This is a booth. This is this is like a whole world in here. If you haven't heard of CES, this is where all the top technology in the world gets released. If it ain't here, it ain't happening. It's filling my lungs, burning them. He was a brilliant man, working tirelessly. He boldly go where no man has gone before. And had to wear a mask to conceal his face. There are two major things that are being released here at CES. One, self-driving cars. A lot of companies are going to talk about self-driving cars. Even Sony is going to be involved in the, the lenses and the cameras that are going in these cars. Number two is AI. We're going to get a tour of like some new products they're coming out with. CES is wild. It's massive. Thousands and thousands and thousands of people here. No way. <laughs> you guys there the whole time? Yeah, I was standing right there. Oh, good to meet you. Good to see you. Welcome, bro. Welcome. Great to see you. Is you put it on, you push it in, and then you twist. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's so secure. My problem is like my headphones always they always fall out when I run. So it feels really secure. I like the fact that you can take text messages without like using your hand and actually reply just talking right so it texts it out for you while you're working out so you don't have to put down any weights or anything you just multitask multitasking is very important these days wrestlers I was just watching that jumped at me for camp. Um, made up of 20 RX Zeros, which is the new camera by Sony. It's like super tiny and creates this like totally new experience. <sighs> this is so overwhelming. There are so many rooms. There's every every company is here. It is incredible to see all these things that are going to be happening in the near future that seem so futuristic still, but it's happening, like, future is now, and it's crazy to be part of it and see all of it firsthand before, like, everyone else sees it. We've been walking for, like, 15 minutes straight to, like, find one booth in one direction. Sweet! So this company behind me is called Furion. They're the ones who sponsored our fridge, our stove, our oven, and we've never met in person. So we'll get to meet them now. Yeah, so actually, what? I'm one of the guys that works on this. What is this place? What? This is very badass. Look at this. So there's like a whole touch screen here. I can see everything inside. So this is our dual induction cooktop. We have this. Available yeah, now. We have, we have this one. Yep. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa, wait till okay, you see keep this. in mind we're in an RV right now. Like, this is not somebody's house. This is on wheels. Living in an RV or in a trailer can be luxurious, as you can see. Look at this damn shower. Come on. Wow. Look at all these lights and jets. Look at all these features. What are all these buttons? Oh. A smart toilet. It's not, we don't have it on right now, but if you were to go in front of it, like the lid would just automatically like flip up. Um, it's got, it is a bidet as well. Nice. So you can, yeah. <laughs> um, it's got a heated seat, 
and it's also, it can dry you as well. Wow. If you guys aren't already impressed, there's more. This is ridiculous. There's a goddamn chopper on the RV. Can we get one? Okay. Luna we needs a helicopter. We should get one. Yeah. And a hot tub, please, please. Okay, now you guys are gonna see something very badass behind me is like a man-operated robot. Somebody would go in this thing and control its limbs. How is Furion doing such cool shit? It's day two of CES. There's a lot of people here. Our goal is to like explore one exhibit hall per day because there's so much here. So right now we're gonna like, which one, which hall is this? this I don't is even know. Augmented reality and yes. VR. This is called the Zenbo robot, and it can like read stories, it can interact with you, it's got a camera, it can see you. If you get into trouble, it can like call emergency, it can call family, and it like moves around. It's on this like little wheel thing. And it can like buy your groceries. Buy your groceries! This is like a friend of the future. This is like like Wally the robot. DJI Ronin Gimbal. And is, is this even on the market yet? Not yet. It's Not uh, even... just a prototype. We're going to the show. The uh, public version will be uh, actually released in the second quarter this year. Wow. I've been saying the industry needs this for years. Underwater drone. It's like a submarine with a camera. I think 30 meters, yeah. I would say. Yeah, your phone goes to the Yeah, it, it's pretty heavy. Like, this, is, this is a good 12 pounds, 15 pounds maybe. Yeah, we definitely need one of these. There are robots everywhere. They're taking over the world. There's one here, over there, tons over here. I don't know if I trust them. But I also kind of want to be their friend. I'm very confused. <laughs>
limitations. So like men can be women, women can be men. We do different heights, sizes, ages, skin tones, hair texture, anything you like. Can you explain that quickly one more time? Yes. So here at Psychosec, we produce 100% organically made human sleeves. Here is an example of the two. So the whole point of this is to have your conscious mind but in a different physical body. Let's just say if your child gets hit by a car and dies, you'd be able to retrieve him back but in a different physical being. That whole thing with the chip in the neck and the body. Uh, Kristen thought that was real. Listen, I'm gullible. I was like fully like, uh, this is ridiculous. This cannot be real. No, it's fully not. Fully thought it was real. That was an ad for a new Netflix series coming out. But Sia, okay, so Sia walked by pretty quickly and I was like in there for a while because I was like, this is the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. And then I'm like, you gotta come back. He's like, you know, it's just a Netflix series, right? And I was like, genius for Netflix to have something here and people actually think that it's real. I'm listening to people like listen to the, the spiel and they're like what about my soul? What's gonna happen to my consciousness? I fully thought it was real. Genius, genius. Netflix. Good job Netflix. You Killed it. Me.